Today we will continue with the first lesson in chapter 6, writing equations in one variable. Yesterday we stopped here at example 2. Let's go back and see example 2. Can servers decorate 25 tables for a wedding? Each table is decorated as shown. Look at the picture here. Let's see be the total number of yellow and purple candles. Which equation can you use to find C? We have four choices here for C. Okay. We should first use the verbal model to write an equation so let's use let's use what we have here but i will write it in english first then i will convert it to math so let's write it the verbal model the total number of candles should be the number of candle uh, of tables times the number of candles on each table here the total number of candles is what we need to find or c and the number of tables is 25 it's given in the question what is the number of candles on each table in each table can you help me Okay, simply look at the table and count how many Mr. yellow. Ibrahim, can I say? Yes. Ten candles, Mr. Ten candles. Ten. Yes. How many yellow and how many purple? Four I yellow. Mr. Yellow is four and the purple is six. Great. Because we have here four yellow and six purple. So. I will write it in parenthesis 4 plus 6. Now let's write it. Because C is the total number of candles. So the equation is C equals 25 multiplied by 4 plus 6. So which one is the correct choice? No, no. B, B, B. Yes, B, B. the correct choice I'm is stop, B. Stop stealing my answers. <laughs> okay, uh, back to the book. And before we move to the real life problem here, it looks easy. Okay, Be before we <laughs> solve this, I need you to go to page two hundred forty nine. 249 and here we have I uh, need you to solve these questions so let's start so we start with this question question number 15 Okay. Rawi? Yes, mister. A number decrease a number y decreased by nine is eight. Uh, Rawi, do not waste time. Use your mic. Yes, yes, mister. A number y decreased by 9 is 8. What should we do? Use your mic. Uh, we must... Uh, it. Mm. 
Okay, do you need help? Yes. Okay, I will ask you questions and you respond to me. Where is the, the word that means equal to? Equal to? Uh, by. I mean is, is. Is. Is means equal sign. Now, yes. the first expression is the expression to the left here. And the second expression is the expression to the right. Yeah. So let's start with the first expression. A number y decreased by 9. Decreased by means? Um, addition or subtraction? Is uh, minus. So the expression should be y. Minus 9. And is means equals, so let's write it. So y minus 9 equal 8. Okay, I'm going here. But because I don't have enough space here, I will write it here out. So 9. Uh, sorry, you said y minus 9. And yes, of course, decreased by means that we should start with y. So y minus 9 equals 8. Okay, thank you, my hero. Great work. Faris is 8. Hamad? Yes. Okay, Hamad. Do not yes. turn off your mic. Question 16. Yes, teacher. Question 16. The sum of a number x and 4 equals 12. Addition. Yes, sum of means addition. Yes. So uh, so we have to add the plus. Yes. Yes, that's right, we Hamad. Have to, we have to add x and 4. We have to make it 12. Uh, so what should I write? What is the equation? Wait. Uh, 8 is not an equation. Okay, I will help you, Hamad. Where is the equal sign? The equal sign? Equal. In the middle of the numbers. Equals. This word yes. means the equal sign. Okay, so start with this expression. The sum of x and 4, you said that the sum of x and 4 is? x plus 4. And after that, you have the equal sign. Then yes. the second expression. Yes. What is the second expression? It's 12. 12. So the equation? is x plus 4 equals 12 and you cannot say that uh, the equation is 8 because 8 is not the equation i'm not asking about the value of x i'm asking about the equation okay uh, before we continue my heroes here i need to ask i need to ask you about the meaning of equation what do we mean by equation anyone Anyone can use the mic now. What is the meaning of equation? I'm Mustafa, can I answer? Yes, Mustafa. Is it two equal expressions? Excellent, Mustafa. So, the equation is two is a, is a mathematical sentence in which we have two equal expressions. So every time find the equal sign, 
find the first expression and find the second expression. Just write them. Okay. Okay, Hamad. Okay. Okay. Thank you, my hero. Al Maray. Al-Maray, Mana, Muhammad Qasim, Yes, Question 17, go ahead. Nine times the number B is 36. Okay, where is the equal sign? The equal sign is... The word is... B. B? No, it is. Okay, so what is the first expression? It's nine times a number B. Yeah. Times means? Uh, uh, multiply. So we need to multiply. Uh, nine with B. So it will or be? Or the number that is B. So nine times B is? Nine B. Yeah, I and is means equal. Equal. Nine B equal to what? Equal what? The second expression. Thirty six. Yes. Yes. Thank you, my hero. Muhammad Mohsen. Yes. yes. Amira, Mister. Okay, question eighteen. Okay, a number W divided by five equals six. So it will be a number W. It will be W divided by five. Yeah, it will say equals six. Excellent, Muhammad. You're a star. It's super easy. It's like one year old, I think. No F? Yes. Question 19? Yes. Question 19. Okay. Uh, so, okay. Uh, wait a second. I, okay. 54 equals 9 more than T. More than number T. Okay, first, uh, 40. 54. Mr. Do you hear me? Yes, I'm writing with you. Go ahead. Okay, 54 equals 9. Equals 9. 9 more than number T. Means 9 T, I think so. More than means? More than means... Uh, more than means... Uh, plus, minus, plus, plus, minus, plus, minus. When you get nine more, so you add. Ah, oh, time. time. We, we, so we added, yes. We add you. to the T. We add nine I, to the T. So it's plus, T plus, plus. It could be nine T, I told you. No, nine you t. said nine T, my hero. Nine T means nine multiplied by T. Um, okay. 
Okay. You want to hear? Hashim? Hashim? Talal? I'm here. Okay, who's this? Okay, 20. Five is one fourth of a number C. Okay, Talal? Okay. okay. Five is one fourth of number C. Teacher Ibrahim, I finished uh, writing all of it. Uh, okay, Ibrahim. It's so, not lie. Is means the equal sign. Yeah. So it's five equals uh, five equal. One fourth of a number. See, so one fourth is one fourth like this. Yeah. One fourth of. Do you remember what is the word of in math? A fraction of a number. Remember? It's. Yeah. yeah. Multiplication. If you said one fourth of C, so it's but one fourth four multiplied by C. Uh, and one fourth multiplied by C is fourth C. Yes. Okay. Okay, thank you, my hero. And of course, my heroes, in question number 18, you can write it as a fraction W over 5, and you can write it W divided by 5 also. On the line. Okay, question 21. And thank you, Talal. Saad? Yes, teacher, do you hear me? Yes, Saad. Question okay. 21. Uh, 9.5 less than a uh, number n equals 27. Uh, we will minus uh, 9.5 uh, minus. No, N. less than means that you take down 9.5 from the N. I don't understand. So you should start with the N. Okay. Uh, 9 minus... Uh, so N minus 9.5. 9.5 uh, equals uh, uh, 17.5. Uh, where seventy point five? I minus each other nine point. Uh, no, no, no. Uh, you are translating. You are not subtracting. Ah, oh, okay. Equals means the equal sign. And the second expression is. Uh, twenty twenty-seven. Exactly. Okay, I didn't ask you about the value of n. I asked you to just write the equation. Okay. Thank you, okay, my hero. Ali, Ali. Yes, teacher. Okay, Ali. Uh, eleven. Uh, three over four is the question of a. Uh, oh, you're reading. Oh, okay. Yes, is the quotient. Is means equal to. Quotient of means. Uh, divide. Excellent. So, we should divide y and. And uh, 6, 1 over 4. So, y divided by 6 and 1 fourth. I should write it in the same line because of. Of course, I cannot write it as a fraction because we have already mixed it numbers. Okay, thank you, Ali. Great work. Any problems, my heroes? These questions are clear? Yes, teacher.
Okay, now I need you to solve by yourself, so I'll send to you a practice link. And now, let's see the answers. 6 is one third of a number S. Teacher, can I answer? Uh, <laughs> but I don't have enough answer? time for we that. I should answer? do it quickly because oh, okay. we need to take the next example. 17 less than H equals 42. So, equals means the equal sign. 17 less than H, we should change the order. So, H minus 17 equals 42. 6 is one third of a number I S. Can't see your screen. Uh, my screen is not, you cannot see it? No, mister, we can. Any problems, my heroes? There's no problems. Okay, no problems. thank you, Talal. I'm checking. I can see it. Okay. 12 times the number P equals 48. So 12 times P means 12P equals 48. A number Y decreased by 4 is 3. Decreased means minus. And the number Y decreased by, so do not change the order. Y minus 4 equals 3. As you see, my heroes, we are translating words or English uh, sentence to math sentence. That's what we are doing. A number K increased by 10 is the same as 24. Increased means plus, so K plus 10 equals 24 oh in this one here i need help karina played two softball games last week she had a total of nine hits i know she had four hits in the first game okay write an equation determines uh, or det uh, to determine how many hits she got in the second game so uh, the number of hits in the second game let's see it's h the number of games uh, the number of hits in the second game is h in the second game is h and in the first game it's four and the total is nine i need help Which one of these? Yeah, Ibrahim, I know. Yes, Ibrahim. H plus four equals nine. Excellent. So H, which is the number of hits in the second game, plus the number of hits in the first game equals the total number yes. of hits. Thank you, my hero. Great work. Okay, my heroes. Any problems with these questions? No. Okay, no, now back to the book, and we have this life problem. After two rounds, 24 students are eliminated from a spelling P. There are 96 students remaining. Find the number of students who started the spelling B. Here we let us understand the question. You are given the number of students who have and have not been eliminated. You, you're asked for the number of students who started the spelling bee. We have 24 students are eliminated, 96 students are remaining, and we need to make our plan. We'll write it and solve an equation relating the number of students who started the number of students who eliminated and the number of students remaining. Let's use a verbal model. <coughs> uh, and here, the number of students who started minus the number of students eliminated gives the number of students remaining. So, the number of students who started is missing and the number of students eliminated is 24 and the number of remaining students is 96 so the equation 
we will use s for uh, for the number of students who started so it will be the equation s minus 24 equals 96 now this equation uh, you can say that what number minus 24 is 96 so how to solve it we need to add 96 plus 24 so it will be 120 students started the spelling B okay my heroes any problems Okay, thank you everyone. This is the end of our session. See you after the vacation, inshallah. Bye. Have a nice weekend um, yes, and goodbye. It was so funny. Mr. This session was so fun. Thank you, my hero.